Come, let us go before the DJ booth in prayer. God who loves all of creation, not just the divisible cell and the batting eye, the wind, the, the thin thing and the web foot, but the creative, the idea, the notion, the invention, the advance, the poem, the recipe, the new way, the revision, the retelling, the costume change, the recast, the trillion, and the radiant cut. God who loves to spin all things, loves the decision to get up and loves the decision to demand rest. Start again, write the course, move the cursor, new secondary source, all of creation is all of creation. God who is commotion and loves us for the commotion we cause, the stirring up and the troubling our bodies create by our mere appearance. God, you are epic in creation, star stuff and core stuff. You are by heart improvisational and... Lines never spoken, creation, all of it, and we love you today for it, God. God, we thank you for this disco service today, and we ask that you dance with us. We invite you to this sanctuary turned dance floor. We invite you to do what you have always done. Move on our behalf. Move to us, move with us, and move for us. Show us that you are a part of the divine dance. Bless the speakers, singers, poets, preachers, directors, producers, sound decisions for the sound team and make light the load for those on the lights. And dancers here today, God bless them all. God bless the DJs. For you are the original recording and we know that you make yourself available for this, the remix. Have your way in this service tonight, God. God, on this dance floor, floor me. My heart is spent, is spun with every muscle revelation that you reveal to my body in this music called disco. Happy dance with me, God. Rain dance with me, God. Bring up my secret sweat. Draw the baby powder line and dare the devil to cross it. God, you said that dance is good and we who are your children are good. God, thank you, because even in a time of war, this is a prayer for a world that needs a dance floor that feels like an altar. <laughs> from Prospect to Lake Merritt, from Brookhaven to Griffith, from Lincoln to Jackson Park, out of bushes shame and branches shame, where our love has learned to creep like vining plant. Break open the circles, jerk, hold on to other limbs attached to hands and arms and eyes and souls. Unnoose and free yourself, some new strange fruit, unafraid of sun, shadow, sex. Let the children come. Let the sons come and come fathers and fathers' fathers. Hear their worst fears, your hen-pecked voices cracking with laughter. You, their chipped heirloom china broke. Let them hear your pitch-perfect ear-ringing slap-high laughs. Avenge your mother's covered giggle tongues. Laugh at the men who won the bread and beat the sissy out of the boys' backs. Let the sons come. Let the snap queens come. Let your good girlfriends and your good, good girlfriends see you snap. Snap because the universe needs reminding sometimes that you are its song and its progeny, your fingers finding place in it, this music. Snap to mark where you enter. Snap to rub your memory's stubby baby fingers together. Make a new noise. Snap your father's please. Snap to turn your fingers into fists. Snap because you have not been the same since, but you vow to be. Let the children come. Let the children walk, the nobody ever stepped on your toes walk, the feet unhurt walk, the dance floor is altar walk. Walk, children, loose the bellies, untangle the T-cells tangle in our bloodstream. Don't let this diagnosis be the partner that leads. Loose your burden, come, children, come, let the children sing. Choke up the screams you have swallowed all your lives. Spit out every word gospel, every word lullaby, every word aria. Fight for the vocal cords tired of singing at our lovers' funerals. Fight for this dirt grabbing hold and grabbing our voices. There is lullaby yet left. Let the children come. Let the children sing some new words for some colored boys' death song come to life. Let the children come. Let the children come. Let the children come. So, so my project um, was on Sylvester, um, who's, who, who's the occasion of the 30th anniversary of his passing would be this month um, in 2018. So he's been gone 30 years. Um, and so I'm 
52, so he passed when I was two. Um, <laughs> and, and as much as I loved going into the archives and having his body presented to me with white gloves, you know, and me exhuming the body of Sylvester, you know, and I was there on World AIDS Day. Um, it was, it was sacred. Um, it felt right um, that these black gay hands were in this body, um, and that we were having the conversation that this world would not allow us to have. Um, and I really wanted to invoke his name um, in this project because I knew this anniversary was coming up. So thank you for letting me um, call down one of my gay sisters. Um, so I'm gonna just read a couple more. Um, this is called 52. The reasons, too many. Then I love you and no rhyme nor reason makes no sense now as I am coming into myself and you are smelling yours, I have hung the sign out, I'm open. Means knock, means ring, means turn, means enter, means shoes on or off is not the test. Comfortable and if you are, is. You move my couch cushion to the small of your back, move my coffee table with your feet so your legs can stretch. You don't try to outshine my curios. You trinket acting like you a precious moment or something. I'm thinking, this Negro really made himself at home. His channel don't change when I point the remote at him. He stay on the news and he only talk during the commercial, the reasons, global warming, the war, I am ready to apologize for everything I did with everybody I did it with before he showed up and he stopped me cold. Say the risk is not what he can catch but what he might miss. This Negro really made himself at home. And if it's all right, Mr. Marvin, I would like to come back and sit with you in your parlor. I think I might be good company for you. More importantly, I like you, Marvin always did and if you let me yes my shoes off don't have to mean i'm staying just mean i want to get comfortable with you i bring my own whiskey i got my crosswords or i can hold your yarn while you're knitting would that be okay mr marvin the reasons i'm 52 the house plants died too many but i'm open and you take me up on it you don't choose the table or the bed couch tv make me start thinking about new curtains Shears, summer, windows, juleps, fishing trips, tea cakes, processed theology, luminous things, cherry coke, seven day candles, CPAP machines, and yes, this two handed taunt game we plan without keeping score just might go on forever if we let it. And finally, oh no, not that. Sorry, that would have taken this over. Um, so in the name of the father, the mother, the daughter, the son, the three spirit and the ones who are both and neither. In the name of art and culture and making and viewing. In the name of sweat and love and Sylvester and all the disco saints in the great cloud of witnesses and wetnesses. Therefore, since we have so great a nightclub and smoke machine of witnesses surrounding us, let us lay aside every encumbrance and the sin which so easily entangles us, the cult of respectability, and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us. Let us dance, fixing our eyes on the DJ and our hips to the floor. Let us lose our minds so that we can see Miss Jesus on the dance floor, the only one who can wear linen and not get any drinks spilled on her. Jesus, the author and perfecter of faith, the DJ and the spinner, disco twirler and the leaper, Jesus, the Vogue queen, who for the joy, who for the joy, who for the joy set before Jesus himself endured the closing of cables, Loretta's, the garage, the generator, and esta noche, despising the shame and has sat down on the right corner speaker at the throne of God and is ready to go in on our behalf. 
Finally, beloved, I pray that the word that went forth out of their mouths on that dance floor from that bar stool like it will for all the children in all the tea rooms, at all the tea dances, under that lopsided wig and under that anointing, through that first testosterone shot and through that first estrogen injection through the first inkling that you like trans girls, that you really like men, that you like non-binary folks, that you are attracted to gender non-conforming folks, that you want to dance and be held during that diagnosis, in that prayer, through that cry, on that hope, on that dope, while wearing that and lip syncing that. I pray that the word and the reed and the air kiss will not return unto us void, but is accomplishing that which God pleased, landing on the still sweat and tear soaked cheeks and lips of its intended. And yes, God, it is prospering in this thing, in this body, in this wrecked and racked thing, whereto they sent me and spent me all air kisses. I pray one day, children, all of your gifts, all of your unconventional and new and old things that you were called to do, all of your inherent wisdoms, all from the directions from which the di- aspras of your hip spin, we will be welcome and expected in places that you could never have imagined. One day soon, a new song is coming, and you will be amplified in love. One day, you will be both ahead of your time and on time. One day, you, all God's children, LGBTQI and not, will know that whatever and whoever we have outlived, that we, have, we will enter no room and no dance floor without acknowledging the room that they left for us. Ashe, amen, and honey boom. <laughs>